Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Happy new release day. We're coming at you with break two. Pick your team two of 2020 Panini certified football. Um, 12 box inner case. So these master cases are actually kind of big. At the end of the break, we are uh, giving away a box of certified football. The brand new certified football right here. If you bought at least two teams, you'll get one entry, four teams, two entries, so on and so forth. No vet commons chip. They're all donated, all, all the proceeds. We actually sell them and all the proceeds will uh, go to a number of different charities that we support. Children's Hospital of LA, Boys and Girls Club, so on and so forth. All right, so on the 21st, on a Friday, thanks everyone for joining us. Jason did the first half, anything cool come out of the first half? There's Ron with Last Spot Mojo, Double Last Spot Mojo right here, there's everybody else. Thanks everyone. All right, so. Let's pop open this case right here. So you can see four boxes, especially on the top cam right there. There's the other, bo other four boxes right here and the other four boxes right here to make 12. We've got Tua and Drew Brees on the cover here, two autographs and two memorabilia cards per box on average. There you go. All, all familiar stuff. Everyone loves certified. It always does, always a fan favorite from year to year. Good luck, ladies and gents. Don't let me forget that box giveaway at the end. I, I, feel, I have a feeling I will forget. We're talking off camera before we start this recording. If there was, if there is a Tom Sawyer movie, I don't think there's been a Tom Sawyer movie since like the 70s. Could there be a new Tom Sawyer movie? Or what's the thing that people do now? You take a literary figure and then turn him into like a zombie fighter? What if it's Tom Sawyer, zombie hunter? All right? Him and him and Becky, I think. You know, they'll, they'll, they'll battle vampires together. Mike Tower was saying that there's a Tom Sawyer character in the League of Extraordinary Gentlemen. It's him as a grown up and as a... Right, so Rich and Mike remember this. They're saying that him, Tom Sawyer, and Huck Finn were in the Secret Service. Interesting. Agents for the U.S. government. Yeah, maybe maybe they're crime fighters. Maybe that's the next thing in, in fiction. There's New Generation Relic, Van Jefferson. Tom Sawyer, Huck Finn, our secret agents. We've got LaVisca Chenault Jr. to 199. Gold team, Derrick Henry. We've got agents a little bit on the thicker side, almost like almost like the uh, those hog cards in, in Absolute. That's A.J. Brown. That's an insert that certainly will ship. There's Tyreek Hill. This is kind of cool. Sort of the street art, some rugs. I wish he was in his pro gear. There's Antonio Gandy Golden. I'm gonna set these aside. We'll sleeve these up later, just in the interest of time. We wanna breeze through that. Is that a case hit? It caught my eyes. Comic Hunter saying it's a case hit. I'll we'll sleeve it up. There you go. Kyle, I think, has my Raiders, right? Yeah, Kyle Weaver with the Las Vegas Raiders.
And there's LaMichael Pirine, Samaj's brother, I think. I'm actually going to need a few more 120s here. Hang on. Bradley saying that 2020 is not a case. -it. Still looks nice either way. Are there case hits in this traditionally? I don't recall. Maybe they could have added that, added a feature like that this year. There's DJ Dallas, 399. There's Jerry Judy. Wow. Three out of five, Jerry Judy. Looks like the onk of Broncos. That will be for Denver, my rivals. Rick Hoffman with the Denver Broncos. Nice. Even though he is a dirty, dirty Bronco, out of fives and under, do get the train whistle. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! Nice start. Right out of the first box. We got Ross Blacklock for the Texans. Rookie signatures, 18 out of 20. That'll be for Ron. Out of 450, Stephon Gilmore. And I don't have any containers here. Ah, got one. There's one right out, right out there. Look, next box, box two of 12. Oh, was Jason sleeving those 2020 cards? They look a little more common than a case hit, but, but yeah, they're in inserts. So they, they will all ship. It's just these like veteran commons that aren't gonna ship. Antonio Gibson obviously ships, that's a hit. 15 out of 299, new generation relic for I Coppola and the Washington Redskins. Stuff like that will ship, of course. There's Max Crosby to 450. There's Jerry Judy right there. They, they do look pretty cool. Travis Kelsey relic to 299 for the Chiefs. It's going to be for David Allison. Nice clean look here in certified per usual.
CJ Henderson. Oh, I thought there was going to be autographs. Three ninety nine. Their seal of approval, Patrick Mahomes. Certainly gets my seal of approval. I wish he wasn't in the AFC West, though. To 75, there's Cameron Dantzler. And we got four color patch. An autograph, freshman fabric patch auto, Gabriel Davis, 222 out of 249. I think what I remember from, from certified last year and in previous years, I feel like a unique thing was like some of the high numbered cards still get some really nice color in the uh, in the window. David Ivers with the Bills. Buffalo. It's Jordan Love. And there is a mirror signature, Walter Jones. 18 out of 25. Hall of Famer in 2014. Seahawks, Serenity with the Seahawks. There's Tyler Boyd to 199 for the Bengals. There's Devin Asiasi to 299. Next box. Adam, what's up? Cool L article in the LA Times. Just read it. Nice. Thanks. I actually haven't read or watched it yet. <laughs> But I will later tonight. I was there. I know what I said. <laughs> I actually don't remember what I said. Well, share it with your friends, Adam. Share it with your friends. Let people know. Acres, new generation relic. It's a 299. I think that article might be in print in the Sunday edition, is what I'm hearing. So I got to go around town and find where do people buy newspapers anymore. Cam Acres, Trey with the Rams. Grocery store, maybe? Out of 99. Kind of hard to read the red against there. Anthony Gordon. Jasper, what's up? You sent to your family explaining what all the packages in the mail are. <laughs> nice. There's Antonio Gibson. New generation relic. Yeah. That's, Adam, that's actually a really great call. I've got a suggestion for everybody. If you have a hard time explaining to your friends, your family, your spouse, your siblings, your coworkers about all those small brown boxes you end up getting from jazbeescasebreaks.com, and if they have a hard time wrapping their heads around it, just send them that LA Times, I'm gonna drop it in the chat. Send them that LA Times article and be like, see, LA Times takes it seriously, so should you. I know I hear some commentary every once in a while. There's Cole Komet right here. Hey, my wife, my girlfriend doesn't understand this whole thing. She doesn't let me break as much with you guys. I'll tell them that, you know, show them the article and just be like, hey, you guys are legit. They're in the LA Times. There's Antonio Gandy Golden. Autograph. That's a catch right there, too. I'll give that a catch. 101 out of 349 for Coppola and the Redskins. Yeah, <laughs> Birch. Yeah, getting the mail before the wife comes home. But now you can share the article with your with, with wifey and be like, hey, see these guys are legit. This isn't just some gazette. It's the LA Times. There's Colin Johnson, 
27 out of 50. For the uh, Jaguars, Jaguars, that goes to Colton and the Jags. You know, this isn't a pick of Yoon. Many pick a yoon. It's a uh, uh, LA freaking times. See if that argument works. It may not. DeAndre Swift, three nine nine. I don't care what publication they're in. Had enough. Box. Good luck. We have more of this in the store, folks. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. I think the next one, break three, should be from a fresh master case. Just dive into, dive into another one. Derek Henry, Stars, Jalen Hurts, Tyreek Hill to 50, Mahomes, Joe Reed, wide receiver. Let's see, these are, when it flips around like this, they're trying to trick me. Chargers, Rich has the Chargers, Herbert Hunting. AJ Dillon, three color jersey autograph to 449. Look at that, look at that color you get for 449. Not bad, Ron Wester and the Packers. And there's Deshaun Jackson, certified gamers. 54 out of 75 for the Fly Eagles Fly, Ron Wester, last spot mojo. TJ Watt to 199. KJ Osborne to 999. And more Eagles, it's Carson Wentz. 224 out of 299. Sean Jaspi hates Carson Wentz. Must have kicked his dog at some point. Goes to Ron and the Eagles. And KJ, uh, there you go, KJ Osborne, autograph for the Vikings. That's to 199. Vikings, Tony, Tony B with that one. All right, next box. Any crazy NFL news happening? I feel like I've just, with baseball, see, with the baseball season, playoff basketball, I just have not been paying attention to, to the NFL. Washington's Rivera, Ron Rivera has cancer? Eey. Yeah, Ron Rivera diagnosed with cancer but plans to continue coaching. Diagnosed with a squamous cell carcinoma located in a lymph node the team said in a statement, Rivera said the cancer is an early stage and considered very treatable and curable. Okay, that's good. All right.
Oh, is that a, it's a skin cancer? All right. I'm planning to go on coaching, he told, uh, told uh, Schefter, Adam Schefter. Doctors encourage me to do it. They said, if you feel strongly, do it. Don't slow down. Do your physical activities. But everyone keeps telling me by week three or four, you'll start feeling it. Oh, is a form of skin cancer to kept reading. That's what the Mayo Clinic is saying. Usually not life-threatening, but can spread through the body and then cause serious complications. All right. So there you go. We'll get well soon, Ron. Hopefully, hopefully nothing too too serious. Doesn't sound, well, it's serious, but not too, not that scary. But hopefully, quick recovery for him. There's Drew Brees, 99. And there's Lynn Bowden Jr. A wild cat has appeared. Four out of 99. You got a little bit of the white, a little bit of the silver, a little bit of the black. That goes to Kyle and my Raiders. Could be in the Wildcat a lot this year. Jeff Gladney, autograph for the Vikings, 21 out of 25 for Minnesota, Tony Best. Ryan Tannehill to four, four fifty. Yeah, four fifty. Anthony McFarland. Here's a twenty twenty Justin Herbert. Maybe for Rich and the Chargers. Maybe we'll find his find his ink somewhere in here. And there's Keyshawn Vaughn, 122 out of 199. Buccaneers, Ryan L. There's Dalvin Cook. Is he staying with Minnesota? I thought he wanted out. What's his, what's his story, Vikings fans? That's the 50. There's Derek Barnett. Relic. Oh, is that some turf in there? 23 out of 149. Certified gamers relic for Ron. I don't know. It says game more material. Looks like a bit of turf in there. It's pretty cool. More Eagles. John Hightower the fourth. That's a catch to 299. And Keyshawn Vaughn again, 2020. Next box. Bills is Norman, injures hamstring out indefinitely. Death Star, Davis, welcomes Raiders to Allegiant. Wildfires in Northern California causing the Niners to alter practice. Jags DL Morrow gets five game ban for PED violation. Dunbar, thankful for support during robbery case. And apparently Joe Burrow led the offense in Bengals scrimmage. Should we hype up some Joe Burrow here? Get the Joe Burrow hype train going? The Bengals conducted their first scrimmage of the preseason, and rookie quarterback Joe Burrow showed control of the offense, Coach Zach Taylor said on Friday. During his first two drives, Burrow only had only one incompletion and threw a couple touchdowns as he continued the process of getting ready for the season opener against the Chargers on September 13th. He did a, a nice job communicating and had some nice drives for us. Coach said in a teleconference afterwards. Joe Burrow was 9 for 10 passing for 101 yards and two touchdowns in his first two drives. According to the pool report, Burrow finished the day with 13 of 19 passing for two touchdowns, including the team's situational drills. Even with the top wide receiver with top wide receivers AJ Green, hamstring, and John Ross, reserve COVID list, Burrow had no problems finding his rhythm early. That's good. That's good for the hobby. There's James Morgan, relic for the Jets to 299. Kyle Weaver, by the way, called CD in this box. So let's see if his powers of sorcery are working here. Out of 199, DJ Moore. It's Amari Cooper. 
203 out of 299. I'll go to Kyle and the Cowboys. Yeah, it was close. I saw the logo. I thought, that's some sorcery. We might have, we might have had to burn you at the stake, Kyle Weaver. Throw you into a lake with stones wrapped to your chest to see if you would float or not. Two-color patch and autograph, Van Jefferson. 220 out of 449. Trey with the Rams. Justin Tucker autograph. Mirror signatures. Three out of 49 for the Purple Birds. Aaron Billingsley with the Ravens. For the Bengals, out of 75, Joe Mixon. And we got Neville Gallimore to three ninety nine. All right, next box. Good luck. One of the Joe Burrow's touchdowns went to Auden Tate. Are we adding to adding him to our fantasy squads this year, Auden Tate? Joe Burrow's low point was arguably a deep ball that kind of hung in the air long enough for a defender to get under it and force an incompletion. But so far, so far, so good. According to actionnetwork.com, the Cincinnati Bengals win total is five and a half. Over or under five and a half? Sean Jackson says over. For reference, uh, Panthers are also five and a half, Redskins also five and a half, Jags are five on win totals. There's James Morgan, Patch and Auto for the Jets to one forty uh, to three forty nine. Ron looking for some uh, Jordan Love in this box here. We got Devin McCourty, Fabric of the Game, the Patriots spelled out in there. That's two ninety nine. That's for Ron Wester, last spot mojo, one of his last spot mojo teams. Got Joey Bosa to 199. Justin Jefferson back here to 299. Cooper Cup. The Rams right there. That looks pretty cool. To 50. There's Dave Krieg, quarterback autograph, 30 out of 75, mirror signature. So a couple old school Seahawk autographs for Serenity Love and the Seahawks. Seal of approval, 7 out of 10, Dak Prescott. Nice low number on that one. That's to 450. The A.J. Brown.
Josh Uchi to 399. And Lamar Jackson. Next box. We've got uh, five box go. This one and then four more in that stack. We are, we are Dunzos. We'll go through some more orders after this. Let's see what else has sold out. I'm assuming that that leaf must have sold out by now. Yeah, yeah. We'll that, that leaf break is coming up. We're gonna have to snack on a little bit of food after this, but we'll do that, go through some more orders, get that leaf knocked out, and make it happen. And a redemption. Any guesses on the redemption? It was Mike Williams to 75. For the Bolts, that's going to go to Rich. Rich has the Chargers. Stephon Gilmore, Zach Moss, uh, that's Zach Moss to two ninety nine. Chase Young, Jersey, 42 out of 199 for the Redskins, that's going to go to Capola. Vance McDonald is an autograph. There you go, to 35. 21 out of 35 for the Steelers. Michael Gallucci has the Steelers. Jonathan Taylor, that's number, that's the 50. 12 out of 50 on that one. And there's Debo to 199. Joe Burrow, Bengals. That'll be for Trey. I don't know if these inserts have any greater value than any of the other ones, but I just I just like the way they look, I guess. There you go. And the Jonathan Taylor, will, of course, will go to the Blue Horseshoes. DeAndre Swift to 399. No no one had any guesses on that redemption. For, bra for bragging rights, what's that? Sean Jaspi guessing Cam Akers. Nicholas Galvin guessing Simmons, Kyle Weaver, hey. C.D. Lamb. We got Freshman Fabric Mirror Signatures Red. Must be the 99 or something like that. And it's C. H A S E Y O U N G Chase Young Nice, so that's for Capola and the Redskins. Nice, you just get a free top loader out of this too. I know Kyle, I saw the C, I thought, it's like, did Kyle call, is there gonna be a C land in there? All right, well, we still have four boxes to go. 
Good luck, everybody. Still, still, still a lot of chances. So play to the whistle. As coaches will often tell you, play to the whistle. Who has the biggest win? To so the biggest win total. So the, we were talking about the Bengals. They have among the lowest win totals according to Vegas. But the biggest win total, Ravens at 11 and a half and the Chiefs at 11 and a half. That's a lot of wins. The Ravens win 11 and a half. Hmm. I don't actually don't know what their schedule is, so. But AFC North's gotta be tougher, right? Steelers are still a tough team. Browns have, have definitely should be getting their act together. Bengals have Joe Burrow. That could be an interesting X factor there. Do the Ravens win 11 and a half? Over or under? What does everyone think? Speaking of the Ravens, there's J.K. Dobbins. 136 out of 225. Aaron Billingsley with the Purple Birds. Nick Galvin needs some Red Birds. There's Clyde Edwards Hilaire. New Generation Relic. Grizzle, no worries. That was a nice Chase Young. And a free top loader, too. A 75-point top loader going your way. There is a top loader shortage. I mean, that that top loader is pretty valuable too. <laughs> it is. Juju Smith-Schuster to 450. There's Jeremy Chin to 399. Yeah, the top loader. A lot, lot, lot of value in that top loader too. You take that redemption right out of that top loader. There's just. Oh, I thought there was gonna be ink there. To 299, new generation relic only, Justin Herbert for Rich Schmidt. There's Traquan Smith. Certified potential autograph for the Saints. That's going to be for Tony. Let's get this sleeved up first, then into. The top loader. To 75 for the Cowboys, Amari Cooper. To 99 for the Cleveland Browns, Grant Del Pitt. And then Jonathan Taylor to 199. Three boxes to go. I might have just enough trash can space for this break. Guys, if you guys look at this, you guys see the LA Times article? It's finally published, had, the, uh, had a picture of the trash can. That was an artsy picture of the trash can. The photographer who was here, some of you may might have been here watching live while that was happening, but. But yeah, the guy was taking multiple shots of the trash. It's like, what are we doing here, guy? It's just getting shots of the trash. Right. It's pretty artsy. Trash can might get its own Twitter account at some point. Might get famous. There's Cam Akers. Three color patch and autograph to 349. You got a message, Brett? Hmm. That's interesting. What, what break number are you in, Brett Kelly? 
We don't really send, we don't send messages for, oh, uh, you confuse us with some other guys. All right, there you go, well, other guys. Cam Akers to, three nine, to 349, Rams, that goes to Trey. Justin Herbert, oh, no ink, Rich. 12 out of 25, we got another parallel here for you, though. There, I guess. Is the gold patch money, though? All right, there you go, Rich. Still want to find some, uh, some ink for you. I'll save a Jordan Love, too. I think Ron's been looking for the Jordan Love. I, I like this parallel a lot. I don't know if it even sells for anything, but I think it looks cool. Raekwon Davis. And Jordan Love, rookie roll call, autograph. There you go. There's the auto, too. Two out of 15. Nice one, Ron. The future is what the Packers organization is hoping. There's LaVisca Chanel, Jr., Relic, Jags, Colton. What's going on? Who what's going on with Jose Alvarez? Oh, wasn't that yesterday? Didn't he he got a I think I remember that. I think Mike Tower mentioned that yesterday. He got a 105 mile per hour comebacker right into the groin. What is there was there an update on that today? Is he okay? That's 25, KJ Osborne. I was like, that name sounds familiar. Why do I remember Jose Alvarez? Oh, no, you, you just saw that? Yeah. We, we watched, I watched the replay. Oh, just need to watch it once, that's all I needed. <laughs> yeah, Capola's more like Jose Alvarez. <laughs> I'm hoping it looked worse. It didn't look like a... Well, I didn't want to watch it again, but I was hoping that it wasn't like a direct shot, that maybe it was just... I don't know. Maybe, hopefully, hopefully there was enough... Maybe there's a deflection in there somewhere that glanced off the end of a glove or something like that when he was reaching for it. Something. Hopefully it's okay. He did finish the play though, right? Yeah. That that was that was ballsy. <laughs> Puns are always intended. Puns are always intended. Um, but yeah, he finished the play. I wouldn't have finished the play. I would have crumpled up. I would have started crying. Um. Well, I don't know. I feel like some players don't wear cuffs. Henry Ruggs? Auto no, no autograph here. 299 though, for Kyle and the Raiders. The pitchers go out there with a cut? I feel like, I feel like that might inter interrupt some of their, 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 their lower body movement. I feel like some people don't. I don't know what his situation was. Darius Slayton to 450. And here's another exciting potential pass catcher for the Raiders, Ryan Edwards. They got some weapons for Derek Carr. What is Derek Carr going to do with those weapons? Kyle Weaver and the Raiders. We got Jason Huntley to 199. And Tyler Boyd to 50.
Chase Claypool. Three color jersey and autograph to 149. That is for Michael Gallucci, Seal Curtain and his Steelers. Nice one, Mike. Did Roland, did Nolan Ryan finish the game after taking a ball to the face? They just, they just made they just made ball players differently back then. There's Kenneth Murray autograph, 26 out of 199. Sean Jaspi, tell tell us about Kenneth Murray. Wow. Awesome dude. Is is he one of them? No, he is not disabled. He is there. He's actually like biological. Oh, they were disabled. Kids. Okay, okay. I see. I see. I see. Along with the biological kids, got it. All right. So it comes from a good family, Rich Schmidt, and the Los Angeles Chargers. Well, can he play football though? <laughs> There's Chase Claypool. It's like, all right, all right. He's a good guy. He's a good guy. We get it. We get it. Can he play ball though? <laughs> All right, there you go. There, there's your, there's your uh, background, Rich Schmidt, on a, uh, on a potentially very good player. Was that what it was? Oh, you couldn't understand him, Capola. Um, in the background, he, uh, Sean Jaspi, was, he was a big Chargers fan. He was, last box, ladies and gentlemen. By the way, pick a team too. Um, he was, he was saying that his grandfather or his father, Kenneth Murray's dad, is a reverend. And at their, at their church, there were a few disabled children that were up for adoption. They took them up for adoption and raised them along with the uh, with with his biological kids. So. so he's a big brother to three disabled adopted children. But can he play ball though? His name, his, his nickname is K9, and yes, he can play. Okay. He's a he's going to be defensive rookie of the year. Wow! You heard it here first, folks. Right here. August 21st, 2020. Defensive Rookie of the Year. And what happens if he doesn't win? Do you, what, what's his punishment if he doesn't? I mean, anyone could just say anything, right? All right. Kyle playing to the whistle. He needs that CD lamb here. He's begging now. This is KJ Hamler for the Broncos. Three color patch to, uh, to 99. Rick Hoffman, that's 29 out of 99. Well, the class, I gotta look that up. I'm sure if I see it, I'll remember it, Rex. Remember when, uh, remember when Max Scherzer was uh, practicing bunts? And he was kind of, kind of maybe a little lazy about it and then the ball popped right up into his face and he had that, maybe broke his nose, maybe he had that mean black eye. Remember that? And then he like, he pitched the next day, made the start. There's Cole Komet, new generation relic, second one here. Should, so does that mean a couple more autographs to close out this break? I think so, two and two. That's for the Bears, that's for David. There's Christian Fulton, not an auto, 299. There's Derrick Henry to 99. And then we have Zach Moss. Three color jersey and auto to 499. That is for David Ivers and the Bills. Buffalo! Oh, you don't remember it, Rex? Look it up. He's got, he's got like a mean black eye right here. And CJ Henderson is your last autograph of the break. That goes to the Jaguars, and that, that's Colton with the Jags. There you go, Colton. And there you go, everybody. 12 box, inner case, pick your team two of the brand new 2020 Panini certified football in the books. Oh, I'm giving away a box too. I remembered, I didn't forget you guys. I, was, I felt like I was about to, but my brain said, Joe, you might have something else to do. And then I racked my hard drive, scanned through, my tasks, and I realized I needed to, uh, 
realize I need to do a giveaway, and I'll do a, ran uh, a recap here as well. All right, so let's flip back to, I know they're randomizers, right? Yeah, no, good. Let's flip back to this list. So it's you've seen this promo before, and I'm sure everyone read the item description. Two spots gets you one entry, four teams gets you two entries, six teams get you three entries, so on and so forth for a chance at a sealed box that we're shipping to you sealed as well. We're not gonna open it, but a sealed box of this 2020 Panini Certified Football. So let's see, let's alphabetize by your first names. Aaron got two, so that's an entry. David got two, that's an entry. Coppola got two, that's an entry. John, you got three, two count, still an entry. Kyle got two, that's an entry. Rhea got two, that's an entry. Ron got four, that's two entries. Ryan got two, that's an entry. Tony B got two, that's an entry, and Trey got two, that's an entry. Nice, let me just spot check this again. I didn't miss anybody, right? Aaron, David, Coppola, John, Kyle, Rhea, Ron with two, Ryan, Tony, and Trey. All right, perfect. All right, so that one spot in 11 is gonna get that sealed box. I don't know, what are the box prices of these? Not sure, I'm sure it's a good value though. Let's roll it, let's randomize it. Name on top after seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, and good luck, seventh and final time. It's Kyle Weaver, there you go, Kyle. After seven times, no CD lamb for you, but a box, a sealed box of 2020 Panini Certified Football, if you rip it, let me know if there's a CD lamb in there. How cool would that be? Didn't get in the group break, won the box from Jaspies, ripped it open, found the CD lamb autograph. That'd be cool. Let us know if that, that magic happens. Recap. About an hour long break, deserves a recap. Really nice hits, a lot of eye candy. Four hits a box, two relics, two autos a box. So a lot of, uh, a lot of chances to chase a lot of big hits. At first, you don't succeed. I would try, try again. There's more in the store right now. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. There's a Chase Young redemption. Joe Burrow 2020 insert. That was Dak Prescott was out of ten. Look at that. There, there's some game used turf in there for sure. On that Derek Barnett. More 2020 cards, those quarterbacks. Nice Lynn Bowden Jr. for my Raiders. There you go, Colin Johnson. Walter Jones, there's a couple of old Seahawks in this break, if you notice that. A couple old school autographs in there. And the last one here is three out of five Freshman Fabric, my rival, Jerry Judy. That was a nice one for the Broncos. And there you go. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. And I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.